Yo, what's good? It's Baby Xavier in the building, aka Xavi Too Cold. I'm here with Two Lit Promotions, man. We're here for an interview. Man, let's tap in. I'm from the city, I'm from Albuquerque. I'm from the South Valley, I was born and raised there, that's where I grew up. Yeah, I was kind of growing up in Albuquerque, coming up out right here. I mean, it's kind of hard to say, like, to answer that, like, to compare, because, you know, I never really seen what's outside of here, so. But I mean, you know, I had a good childhood, I had my struggles here from time to time. But good memories, bro, was just being a kid, for real. You know, I wish I could go back to that. I remember being a kid and just talking about, like, I want to be an adult so bad, I want to be grown and this and that, but I take it back to my childhood, it was, I had the best memories, it's just coming up as a young. Yeah, man. Mainly when I was hooping. I was hooping all throughout when I was a youngin through like back in YMCA days, middle school, AAU. Bad memories was probably honestly just like the school part of my struggles and then just like, you know, we've lived low income my whole life too. Like we didn't have nothing, you know what I mean? Getting through them lows, man. Just having my family through it all. You know what I mean? Growing up with a single mother. That's all I had. Who got you into the music? Into the music. Honestly, I, I just like really started like falling in love with the culture by the time I was in like middle school. Just seeing more about the rap like about rappers and like their come up and their story that's what i fed into hearing them on like their own sound it's just i, know, I wanted to, i wanted to have that too i wanted people to know like where i come from and, like hear my sound and, how would you kind of like define yourself you're an artist you are what would you say i define myself as an artist i mean i know i'm not on platforms or nothing yet but you know that's coming real soon well i remember when i was a young and in like middle school i looked up to like mainly like x xxx and Tassion. i looked up to lil wayne too drake was always in there what's your most popular song most popular song is Snapping. It's only on SoundCloud, but within, I think it was about a week, it hit like 35K or something like that. Honestly, bro, I just came up with the name when I pulled up, to, my first time pulling up to the studio because I pulled up, bro, like I had shit written in my notes and like I was, I had the beat ready and everything, but I didn't even have a rap name. My name is Xavier, so I just kind of summed it up and shortened it and then just Xavier, I don't know, it popped in my head. It was like the first one to pop up, but it's a too cold. I don't know. I fuck with Trey Young in the NBA and he always do this shit where like he's cold. I fucked with that, so. Future plans and goals is just mainly to get myself out there more, mainly to get my name out. I want to be heard. I want to get a buzz and then just take off from there. So what's your thoughts on the Albuquerque scene? On the Albuquerque scene, I mean, shit, I'm still new to the game, bro. I feel like I haven't seen, you know, every side of it, but from what I've seen so far, man, I fuck with it. You know, it's all love out here in the city. Like, you know, shout out like my artists like PZ, you know, Scuzz, all them. They cool, bro. They were welcoming in the game and I want to get to work with them and stuff. Shit, I'm a mainstream, bro. That's the goal, man, is to get on there and then start making me some money to start taking care of who I got around me in my circle. Yeah, that's the main goal, bro. But I'm not trying to fall off though. Like once I'm on the mainstream, I don't want to be like a one-hit wonder type. You know what I'm talking? But honestly, all I can say is just be all into yourself, for real. Just like I said, promote yourself and put yourself out there as much as you can. Cause I know a lot of people like to make music and like just keep it to themselves. And like a lot of them are hard. A lot of the tracks I've heard that people don't put out there are hard. And, you know, I think you just need to put yourself out there and just show your creativity in a new way. Fun facts, some I mean, people don't know about me. Uh, I don't know. The only thing I can think of that's kind of funny is my voice, bro. Like I know, like everybody look at me, bro, and I'm like, you know, I know. I don't even think I sound like this. They think I'd be a squeaker or some shit. But then they talk to me and my uh, that's just the only thing. You believe in aliens? Hell yeah, bro. You telling me we got a whole universe out there with no other living beings out there? You can't tell me there's not no other living beings out there. My favorite food gotta be tacos or wings. Words of encouragement, just going through the struggles, man. Just trust the process. I know it's hard right now and it's gonna be hard for a while. The more you keep working, this shit will start coming more as a habit. That's all I can say. You hear about Tulip promotion. So when I was in high school, I would remember like all the like events and like parties we would host and stuff and like all that. But and then I started seeing you more in the music scene and like seeing shooting music videos, you know, shooting like the shows and events of like peso peso and all that. And then I'm like, oh shit, you know what I mean? Like and then all of a sudden, shit, I just started making music. I have been like following your page and I was like, damn, well I do this shit now, so let's tap in, let's make a music video. For real, bro, like let's get into it. And then you was throwing those open mics too. And I was like, I love to perform. And anybody I want to shout out. Just the guys from the city, PZ, Scuzz, Pezzo. Shout out my young and Zayo. You know, you coming up with both the producer and the rapping. I guess all I can say to end this off is just one thing, 
that I'm trying to do. I'm not trying to put an image out there to make me look like, you know, no villain or nothing or to make me look like I'm putting a bad message out there for the kids and the youngins or just anybody in general. You know, I want to put an image out there to spread love and positivity through, you know, everybody, through every soul. Everybody that fuck with me or that write for me, that listen to me, anything. That's the main message I'm trying to get out. Shit, man. ABQ, shout out my city. I'm finna catch y'all. Stay blessed, man. So you gave me too cold out this way. <laughs>